So how's this thing work? Yeah, you know, just put it on and you'll see the future. I don't recommend it, though. No choice. I need to know what's going to happen, and what I need to do to stop it. The real question is... How far are you willing to go? I guess we'll see. <laughs> well, big oh, shock. That was disappointing. You're telling me I have to live in this toilet. Nelson, you're still... A ghost! Pretty much. But don't let it fool you. It's not all it's cracked up to be. I still have to pee at three in the morning. Look, I can see this is becoming a conversation, and, uh, no. Oh, that makes me sad. Yeah, so am I. Look, I need to see the future. Can you help me or not? Isn't that, like, the only reason anyone comes here? Oh, no one comes here. Oh, your god, is that me? Honestly, I never thought I'd last that long. Yes, you look even older than me. How many of our friends are buried out there, huh? How many, Bruce? All of them, Oliver. Wait, you mean that's Ollie? I regret so much. If I had taken things seriously back then, if I had stepped up and taken office instead of him, maybe this wouldn't be hell. What the hell happened to you, Oliver? Well, after Blue Boy ripped off my arm, I pretty much sobered up. I didn't even realize I had a beard all this time. But the real question is, what are you gonna do, Bruce? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Can we skip this? This isn't one of those new fancy Betamax doohickeys, you know. How old are you? You know what? No, doesn't matter. Just forward a bit. Give it up, Bruce! You fought the regime for years, and now look at you! Old, alone, and dressed like Robocop! Well, you know how it goes, Clark. You either die a hero, or you live long enough to become you. You can't talk to me like that! I'm the president! I think that title stopped having any meaning after you cancelled elections and declared yourself Overlord! To be fair, that was Alfred's idea. <laughs> you know, Clark, all these years later, it finally hit me. You're not people. <laughs> and no parent's name is gonna stop me from finishing the job this time, you motherless alien f If I was any less of a man, I... You'd still be a blue prick about to become a red state. I hate you! I super hate you! And I bad hate you! Jesus Christ! Right? Like, take it down a notch, fellas. I know it's DC, but jeez. This can't be how it happens. Really? Uh, seemed inevitable to me, and I only met you two that one time. Enough, Bruce! I don't want to kill you! I wouldn't want to kill me either, Clark. How about you, Ollie? Yup. <laughs> if you ever wondered why I never did this before, it's because deep down, despite all your stupidity, I still believed in you. What about your one rule? Fuck my one rule. Uncensored. <laughs> no! Well, that was dark. No, 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 that can't be it. We can't let that happen. Ha <laughs> ha! Bruce has feelings. Bruce has feelings. I will exercise the shit out of you. Does the name Constantine ring any bells? Maybe there is another way. Normally, after wearing the helmet, your mind will do a few jumps into the future until the magic's out of your system. But maybe I can make it so it sends you elsewhere. What are you talking about? Now, I may just be an old ghost with arthritis, but in my experience, people like that only listen to one person. Oprah! I mean themselves. Yeah, that sure helps me. Just have to get him talking to a mirror, then. There's other ways. Other Earths. Other... Supermen. But that's annoying. Find the right one, and who knows? Maybe you can save Superman.
We can have a lot of fun. Young Justice B Hatches. I'm a man. Me and Vice President Alfred have so many fun ideas to get to work on. Just last night he was telling me all about his initiative for a homeless barbecue, which sounds neat to me, although still not clear why we would need to round them all up for that. Vandal, buddy, ha. <laughs> Explain this to me. Well, he won. And we didn't see this coming! I think we can all agree no one saw this coming. You mean I smiled, waved, and hugged all those simpletons just so he could beat me again? Honestly, Lex, one would think you'd be used to it by now. Oh, snap. You know, this is exactly why we have to take over, because this. This is what happens when you leave things to the common people. They're all as stupid as him. No wonder so many think chocolate milk comes from goddamn brown cows. What, that's a thing? Maybe this is a bad time, but I should mention someone freed the Harper asset. What? Someone freed the Harper asset. I really can't hear you. Someone freed the Harper asset. Well, just kill me. He very well might. I just wanted to make sure you were doing okay before I left the planet. You're leaving Earth? For how long? Oh, four to eight years. We'll see how things go. Tornado will keep an eye on you. Don't you f***ing look at me! Don't you worry, Uncle John. I'm sure this whole thing will work itself out like the Great Plague back in Mars. You mean the one where millions died? The one that's literal translation means horrible agony? Yup! And didn't the horror end eventually? I'm going to go pack. Don't you two have a mission with Batman? Yeah, uh, speaking of which, you might want to hide that symbol when we're outside. Not everyone is a Superman fan right now, you know. Hmm, this wouldn't be another one of your tricks to get me to take my shirt off, would it? What? I stopped listening after... abs. I didn't say anything about my abs. I am trusting you to keep things under control for me until the deal is done, Monsieur Simon. The others think that the man might send his meddlesome kids in there. Can I trust you to handle it? Lady, I don't know why the fuck you sound like Pepe Le Pew finally got Penelope pregnant, but if it's about handling a bunch of irritating pansy-ass mini-adults playing Metal Gear in my backyard, consider it fucking handled. I don't know what I'm going to do, Dick. Superman takes the oath of office tomorrow, and if I don't stop him somehow, well, let's just say you won't have to worry about global warming as much. Well, magic isn't exactly my area of expertise, Bruce, but hey, what if this multiple Earth thing is the answer? I don't know. Not even sure how it's supposed to work. Ah! Something wrong, old chum? Chum? What year is this? Why, the glorious year of- No, you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm guessing this is one of those other Earths. Other what? Look, just answer a few questions while I'm still here. Sure, dippity do. That sounds swell. Okay, how do you feel about minorities? Well, they're just going through so much, I can't help but feel for them. Do you know they have to be escorted by the army to go to school? Terrible. Just terrible. Hmm, not bad. What about the Russians? I think they're a very hard-working people, and I just don't know why we have so many gosh darn arguments with them. Forgive my language. Do you think you're the reincarnation of Jesus Christ? Sir, there's only one son of God, and I am the son of Krypton. You've got your sons mixed up, son. All right. I think this might work after all. Now, on the other hand, if you ask me if women should be allowed to join the workforce, then I'm just gonna have to stop you right there, Bruce old buddy. Oh, no. Don't get me wrong, gals are great and all, but who's gonna clean the house if they're working all the time? Us? <laughs> That'll be the day. Ah, <sighs> so close. That's why I don't wear short shorts anymore. Bruce? You okay? You spaced out on me. Yeah, fine. Just tasting fresh disappointment. Speaking of which, Damien! Get in here, we need to... Be honest with me, Dick. This is me. No, no, no. A little, yeah. Where is he? Well, his tracker shows him a few miles off the coast. Apparently there's an abandoned oil rig there. 
Uh, of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? You know, putting trackers on a kid might be part of the problem. Or it might just be you. You know what really helped me when I was Robin? Sure, don't. Friends. <laughs> oh, where am I? Ugh, sand! I hate sand! It's rough and coarse and... I got boobs. Why? Oh my god, I am Green Girl! How the hell did this happen? And why do my nipples hurt so much? Ah, this costume is so ridiculous! Everything is so tight! Ah, come on! Hey, wake up, kid doofus. Whoa! What's happening? Why am I there? Oh, it's this dream. Like a Guillermo del Toro movie. Nope, this is happening. Artemis. I'm a boy. You seem way too happy about that. Well, I always wondered what it would be like to have- Hey, are you a traffic sign? Because stop! Oh, like I'm supposed to believe you've never been curious about- Hey, do you hear that? Stop in the name of her eminence, the queen! How do you run like this all day? I'm horny all the time, so I use the energy! Man, this is some bullshit. Oh, I know, Robin's computer can help me. Abby, get your ass up, girl. How may I assist you, Mr. Red Robin? I'm Calder, actually. I don't know what happened, but somehow I woke up in Red Robin's body. That sounds distressing indeed. And yummy. Can you locate the others? Negative, but I can locate the last marker he left on the map. Eh, yeah, I have to do. Just hope the others are having better luck. Ah! What in the name of the unfuckable Christ is this? A college workshop? I actually want to get some shit done today, guys. Please stop this at once, you evil. Ah! And as for you, tight jeans, shut the fuck up before I go up there and stuff my whole foot down your throat. These shoes are new, you know.